Friday, and everyone's kind of, you know, just getting here and settling in. But nobody's gonna go! <laughs> so, the best people can. <laughs> Yes, please. Give me more. 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 Oh, no, you know what? Yeah, maybe a little bit more. Can you extend this one? Extends. Hey, 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 hey. Not like the commercial. Are those the stupidest commercials of all time, or what? You know, I... I don't know if I could... I don't know if I could be an actor and like actually do one of those commercials. <laughs> It'd be very strange. I don't know. It must pay them a lot of money. Anyway, um, happy new year. How was your holiday? Did you guys have a good holiday? Can you hear me okay out here? Ah, there it is. See, I was behind the speaker. And back here, it sounds like this. <laughs> And we're back. <laughs> um, thank you so much for being here. We'll have fun. And how many of you guys are going to be here all weekend? Sweet. Those of you that are not raising your hands right now, work something out. Make sure you can stay. Oh, thank you. These tables are not our friend, are they? Let's see how far we can go now. Ooh, we get oh. Okay, that's good. That's perfect. Thank you. Um, Let's see. First of all, before I forget, I got a couple of things I want to make sure and tell you guys. So before I forget, I want all of you guys, or we are in Texas, I want all y'all to come to the concert tomorrow, okay? I promise it'll be fun. And the best part is, it doesn't cost you anything. It's free, so you'll definitely get your money's worth. Um, we're doing a lot of fun things, and I would, uh, would love it for you guys to be there. Um, let's see, what else? Oh, a lot of you guys wrote me uh, emails and said, would I please bring some of my music CDs to the convention? And I did, just for you. <laughs> so, um, I would love for you guys to have those. You have one, you have one, you have four. And, um, <laughs> There are several, actually. Uh, there are some piano CDs, some really nice original music piano CDs. There are some good vocal CDs with a lot of songs uh, that are anime related. And uh, we just passed Christmas. I know we just passed Christmas, but it's always a good time to grab some Christmas music. So uh, I actually even have a Christmas CD. So if you want to hear me going, oh, holy night. Thank you very much. <laughs> that was so bad. How many of you guys heard the duet that Johnny Bosch and I did for Christmas? Y'all missed out! Really? You didn't, see, you, you didn't hear it? Awesome. Um, okay, let me tell you what happened, right? I'm trying to get Johnny to sing it with me. <laughs> um, about two weeks before Christmas, or three weeks before Christmas, um, you guys, how many of you know who Chuck Huber is? <laughs> Chuck Huber is a great voice actor, a longtime voice actor. He, uh, he called me one day and he goes, hey, why don't you and Johnny Bosch do a, a, a duet, a Christmas song duet, and uh, put it together really quick and we'll put it up on our con.com website. And I was like, you know, that's not a bad idea. And so I called Johnny and he said, well, if you want to put something together, dude, I'll, you know, I'll sing it with you. So we picked a, a song and I have a studio in my home and I put all the music together and then I sent it to Johnny, and Johnny recorded a vocal, and he sent his vocal back to me, and then I put it into the session and recorded my vocal. And we made this great duet, and it turned out really good. And Johnny's like, this is really weird, because I don't normally sing like this, Vic. This is not my style, you know. And so uh, we had so much fun doing it. It's, uh, I think it's still up there. I think it's still at con.com. Yes. Uh, so check that out if you want to a nice Christmas smile on your face after Christmas. Um, also, uh, let me tell you about a free present that I have for you. 
Oh, now don't be so sure until you hear what it is, because you may not want it. It's <laughs> I want it, I know I want it. <laughs> what? You have a question? Is it something good? Is it something good? Well, that's a subjective question, isn't it? Some people would think it's good, some people would think it's not. I think it's good. You be the judge, okay? Here's what it is. Uh, about a year and a half ago, I think, wow, it seems like it's, wow, just yesterday. Um, I wanted to create something that I could give to you guys as a way of saying thank you for being so kind and for being so supportive of, of my work over the years. And a lot of you that have done any kind of research about me on the internet, you know that my faith is very important to me, right? I know, I talk about it a lot. I hope I don't offend, but it's, it's, part of, it's a big part of my life. So um, I thought, what would be better than to share something like that that's very important to me personally? So I spent several months in my own studio, in my free time, recording the entire Gospel of John from the Bible. Now before, I know, before you turn me off now, before you start thinking, oh great, that's all I need is to hear Edward Elric reading the King James Version of the Bible. <laughs> Nobody wants to hear that. And I agree. Nobody does. So I, I, uh, I use this really cool contemporary translation. It's very much like we talk nowadays. It's not any flowery, lofty language. And then I gave all of the different characters different little voices. <laughs> so, you know, like, you know, I don't know. <laughs> I'm not gonna tell you, you have to check it out. But like, you know, let me just dispel any rumors right now. No, Jesus does not sound like Tomaki from our <laughs> high school. <laughs> oh, no. Maybe it would be great if he did, right? Um, so uh, anyway, so I put this whole thing together, and it took a long time, you guys, because it's like 21 chapters. And uh, when I finished it, I thought, what could I do to make this easier to listen to? So I went back to the very beginning, and I spent another month playing the piano underneath the whole thing. So it's got a, so it's very much like an audio book, is what it is, and it's very entertaining to listen to, and it's a gift from me to you. So I have them. I'll have them at my autograph session, and they'll be on the table, and if you would like one, feel free to take one. All I ask is if you take it, listen to it. Some people, you know, hand out flyers, and people think that because it's a free piece of paper, they're like, oh, what's this? <laughs> you know, and they just, you know, they just throw it away. It took a lot of work to make, but, uh, but it is free if you'd like to have one. And, there it is. <laughs> So, who wants this one? I want to give this one. Uh, I'll have those. Okay. Now, let's be very calm. Calm down. Calm down. Let's talk about stuff you want to talk about. Let me tell you what I'm working on right now, because I know somebody's going to say, what are you working on? Uh, for those of you that don't know, I'm very excited because we are working on Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. <laughs> the best show ever. World. And <laughs> on the earth and the Lord. Um, but uh, we're having so much fun, you guys. So much fun. Um, when we did the first series years ago, a few years back when we finished it, it was like, okay, well, that was really great. And that's, you know, probably not going to happen again, you know? There was never any clue that there would be any more. And so when they decided to make this new one and to get to play those characters again, and to get to see them in like new settings, you know, and, and new characters and, uh, and new environments and a whole new storyline, it's a lot of fun. So we're having a blast with that. Let me go ahead and let you know also, a lot of people will have asked about Aaron. Uh, it is unfortunate, but of course Aaron doesn't sound like Al anymore. Aaron has done this horrible little thing we like to call puberty. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, yeah, so now, you know, instead of being like, brother, he's like, brother. <laughs> so I'm like, what, Al? So I get all scared now. But, so he, uh, he doesn't sound like Al anymore, so we have, he, he is not playing Al. But I will tell you this, the young lady, Maxie Whitehead, who is playing Al, sweet. I mean, she's awesome. She sounds fantastic. There have been several times when I was in the middle of recording and I